Oh, in this video I am going to show you how you are going to add a freebie as a lead magnet onto your beacon store. So we are going to go to products. Well, you can go to link in bio and then we can check there is a store option you will go to your store you will say add digital product okay you can look at it you can change the design or just follow the prompts we're going to go to the product title in this case it's going to be your affiliate blueprint and you're going to say it is a freebie price we're going to say make product free add your description that you want to add now you can just go and edit it like you want to I'm gonna go back now we're gonna add the media and then the product files now you have one of two options you can upload a PDF in my case I prefer to take a, a preview link from Canva so let me show you what I mean by this because I have noticed that people tend to copy the PDFs and then they sell it as a product so I prefer to add a link so when you're in Canva you go share see all and you want to choose public preview link create public preview link and copy i'm gonna go to the store add link And that's it. So when I so this only means that when we open the link they won't be able to download it physically and they can look at it like this. And if you do have links inside, they can just click on the links. But then they can't copy it and sell it as their own. You will say next, add product to store and list product. Now, next we're going to add emails to our lead magnet. So you will go to marketing, email automations, add new email automation. And when someone purchases a product, I'm going to say use template click on a one where it says any product you're going to choose your product that you want them to be added to the list for and then save now you can go and edit the email and say let's go now you can say yeah, thanks for your download
I normally have a what do you call it a Google Doc where I put all of my emails in Just go and say click here, add link, copy the link and confirm. So when they click there, you can add your blog store, you can add anything you wish to add on it, you can add a button. Um, if you want to edit the email, you, like I said here, you can add buttons, you can add free downloads or anything. Let me just say next because it's the first time. You can edit the design, the colors, you can go crazy with this if you want to. I like to keep it plain. So when we're done with the email, we've put in everything we want to, we can say next. put in the subject line now you have to check sometimes so they don't like <laughs> the word affiliate as you can see so it tells you if it's going to go to spam or not and that's what I like about beacons okay you don't have to put a preview line you can say save I'm just going to add the other emails. Okay, so I have my four emails that's going to go out, one every day for the next four days. And then you just go and say activate automation. And we're going to call this affiliate blueprint. And there you go. I hope this helps.